geography teacher at Albemarle High School is being recognized by the National Council for his work teaching AP Human Geography. Now his students are learning about maps in some unique ways. NBC 29's Kagan Hughes reports. You know, is there another first entered high school I thought geography was super bore it just sounded really boring just like textbook maps where things are but having the ability to do th things like this and see what it, else it can be used for and learning it this way makes it really exciting actually that way is letting students create interactive maps of any subject they want like this one about Taylor Swift concerts across the US Demonstrate your understanding through maps. And so this student wanted to ma understand Taylor Swift's uh, Eras tour. Chris Bunin is a geography teacher at Albemarle High School. He says teaching geography is not just maps and capitals anymore. He says technology is creating a new way to engage his students. 20 years ago, we were using paper maps and asking kids to flip from page 16 to p compare the map on page 200. Now we can just click and turn on and off layers. He says by teaching it like this, students can learn how geography can be applied to real life situations. Modern geography is high tech and it's very relevant. Uh, whether it's site, figuring out um, real estate values to, as you're gonna see today, voting precincts and locations to uh, tracking a package from Amazon, we're, we're using the tools of modern geography. Those tools are turning a subject students thought were boring into something that's interesting. Maps may seem such a boring subject at first, but as you go into it, it's not just the data that you have in just a map. It's also, you can put like the creative ideas you have into displaying this map in ways people will actually want to see it. In Almoral County, Kick and Hughes, NBC 29 News.